In this video, I will show you how to get your Discord token. And if this video does help you out today, then please consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like on the video, and also subscribing to the channel. And with that being said, let's jump straight into the tutorial. So here we are, I'm currently on discord.com. So what you're gonna to want to do first is of course, open up an internet browser and come across to discord.com. From here, what you're going to do is click on to open Discord to open up Discord and log in to your account if you are not already logged in. So next, once you're logged in, you want to come up to the top right hand corner. Now bear in mind, this is on Google Chrome, so it's gonna be a similar process, but this is how to do it on Google Chrome. And what you wanna do is click on the three dots up here. Now be careful when you do this because you don't want to share your token with anyone because by providing your Discord token means that people can actually access your account. So if you do do this, then be careful that you're not sharing your screen or anything along those lines. So once you've clicked onto the three dots, you wanna come down to the more tools option down here, and then you wanna go ahead and click onto developer tools. So what it's gonna do is load up a window like this to the right of the page. And from here, you're going to want to look for application. So normally this is at the top here where it says like elements, consoles, and sources. However, if you can't see it here, just go ahead and click this arrow and you'll see the application option there. So go ahead and give that a click. And then from here, you're gonna to want to come to this menu on the left-hand side and come down to the storage option and click the arrow next to local storage, which is this one here, and then go ahead and click onto discord.com. So what you now need to do is come up to the top again and you wanna click on this symbol here to actually change this to a device, this one here, which says toggle device toolbar. So what you wanna do is give that a click. And then what you can do is come to the filter box over here and go ahead and type token into here. And what I've done is of course blurred out my token for security reasons. But you will see a couple of options. Now the one at the very bottom, which just says token, this actual bit here in the value, which I've blurred out, but you'll be able to see on yours. This is your actual token. So this is what you can do. So you can copy this from here just by right clicking and clicking copy and then you can use that token wherever you may need to use that so i hope this video helped you out today and if it did as i said really appreciate it if you drop down below the video leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel with that being said i just want to take a moment to thank you guys for watching this video and i will see you in the next tutorial